Hey guys, so in honor of hitting 600 subs, which some people might not see is that big of an accomplishment, because I mean, like, I should be celebrating a thousand or something. Um, my parents went out and got me something that I am going to unbox in this episode of Treat Me to Tech. I never thought I'd be doing another one of these episodes. So guys, get ready, because in this episode, we're unboxing... The HP Pavilion. I don't know if the camera will mirror it, but you can see it right there. It says HP Pavilion. Hi guys, so excuse um how big, how gigantic this box looks, man. I mean like, I never thought an all-in-one desktop would have been so big, but basically this HP is what's going to replace this laptop and now we are going to get to unbox it and set it up and show you all some performance tricks because um I had used this in a, how it's called, a demo, it's a beast. Every time I do an unboxing, shout out to DC. So this box is pretty hard to open. So let's see how we can do this. So let's do it from... It sure has a number. Um. Shout out to Price Mats because they are the ones who sold the laptop, the desktop. My bad. And let's see what this bad boy was. So let's turn the desk. Let's turn it like that. And people will say that I'm probably mishandling this computer right out of the get go. Um, I have never seen a silica gel pack this big. Do not eat. I've never seen a silica pack that big. Um, I think I will keep those. Um, next thing is removing. Excuse the jump cuts that probably just happened. Ooh, so on top. Um, I heard about this. This was like the portable um keyboard here, and I need so. Why I say possible, um, wireless. <laughs> so this is the keyboard that we have. So that's the first part. Um, there's another bigger box. Um, we will open all these boxes in a sec. And finally, guys, give me a sec. Hi guys, behold the um HP Pavilion in all its glory. It's a pretty big desktop, but I can make it work. And uh, um, let's open up these small other two boxes that we have before we get to this piece and setting us up. And um, in the process of setting us up, I will have to just do some work before um, I set it up. So give us a sec. So first box, here we go. Um, excuse the camera angle because you know I don't have a camera, man. So what we have in here, we have the power cable. Um, and the mouse, again, expected. And then we have, um, I wonder what the key is for, but like a little Allen wrench key, but do not use it for. <laughs> Guess we'll find out when the time comes. Um, and we have a bunch of like setup instructions for the um, computer. So, um, yeah, I will read those over before I set it up in a few. But onto the other box, and then we'll open up the mouse, and then we'll open up everything else. Um, I was watching a KPK video earlier, and uh, um, recording. <laughs> well, now you all know what I was listening to. 
So now here's the keyboard. Ooh, fancy. Um, it looked pretty nice, to be honest. It, I, <laughs> all this, I had to give you all um, the final thoughts on thing after I finish all this. But for now, let's just put this away and let's check out the mouse. So you just, oh, whoops. You just put down top there and then slip that off like so and I'm guessing the um mouse the USB that you use for the um keyboard the same thing you're using for the mouse oh wait no it has its own USB wait so I do use two USB slots on this I don't even know where the USBs go but uh, let's see what happens alright guys so give me a sec and we're going to fully set up this bad boy I guys on the basics of setting up this PC. Um I'm gonna film myself doing it and oh my gosh. I hold on. Alright, so I'm assuming this box is MCBTW. Um hold on. Yeah, it's empty. So um let's get started by um first moving all, all that rubbish. Excuse my desk because this whole thing has at all. So the first thing we're going to do is just move this bad boy into position. I know it's not going to fit the frame. Hold on. Let me change the angling right there. <laughs> <laughs> um, shout out to one of my friends who apparently was, whose picture is now apparently in this video for like the rest of the <laughs> Oh my gosh. Um, I will leave that there for a bit, and then when they tell me to blur it, I will blur it. Um, so now we have the HP Pavilion right there. Move that. Um, I'm looking because there's no me. There it is. You take this from underneath, pull it off. Look at that beauty. Look at this beauty. And then pull. Wait. If that's informational, I don't think I should take that off. Um. Alright, so let me take that off then. And then finally. Um. Underneath, we should be doing this. Oh my gosh! No, I screwed up. Alright, so we finally got the plastic off. Um, I'm gonna show you something in the back here. Um, so there was a misconception. Don't know if you said it properly. Um, I thought there was only two USB ports, but turns out there's three. So in the process of setting the computer up, I am going to plug this cord in, which is connected to my hard drive, and just go into the boxes for a sec to get um the small USB hold on alright so we set up the back except for um the power cable give up give me a sec to set it up um this is a very big and a very long power cable but I guess that was to be expected because it is after all a like it like it is a desktop after all so this requires like mega mega power to use um I'm gonna have to find a way to hide this cable properly um Alright, so that 
is the final setup and now we are ready to set up set up the computer so already I love the setup of the um pavilion over um the other computer that I was using in the past where it was just their desk um laptops um so now comes the moment oh boy small thing um now comes the moment of truth and this is where we basically turn on the pavilion and see how well it works although um I will start off the gate by saying that this mouse, unless it's meant to drop. Oh, so the mouse is uh, um magnetic, so the cover was coming off like very badly, and I thought that um it was just that the clip system wasn't good. Turns out the mouse is magnetic. So let's see what this behemoth system can do. Woo! Big fancy screen. Um, I hope the reflection does not bother, but I mean like, didn't this happen before in the, um, Switch video? I'm probably gonna have to hide over. Alright, there it is. Um. There it is. There it is. Probably how it's like a first time boots up kind of thing. Um, don't be surprised if oh boy, I will probably um rise up. What am I supposed to talk about? Like, <laughs> first time starts up, kind of what deal? Guys, oh, there it is. Um, what is your country or region? Um, I'm getting sick of playing the United States for everything. And what's your preferred app language? What keyboard layout would you like to use? Pacific time. Everything there is accurate. Um, applying these settings, I do not know if you can see the text. Good, and I don't think the answer is yes, so let me change the camera angling. Here's the legal stuff, yada, yada, yada. Um, if I wasn't being sued by Mythical Entertainment for using one of their lines in uh, um, this song, um, just being honest. Um, I would have totally put that, um, oh shucks, accept that. Alright guys, give me a sec. Alright, um, change these at any point, I think I will. Mm -hmm. Checking for updates, oh boy, this. This is gonna be fun. Um, I will have to hide that. This is why I have to change like camera angles because I'm afraid of the like. I remember watching this video from the Jay Wet who um posted about Lavender Town and then after his video was removed because apparently Lavender Lavender Town is spam or scam, and I was like. What? I could just blur it out. Just a moment. Well, when the computer sets itself up, I guess that is when um it basically. But give me a sec to fix the tripod so that I could show a little more of the screen by elevating the tripod.
Alright, so let me give you all a bit of a little run. Whoopsies. Constant and here. Alright, guys, so I'm gonna have to cut off here for a bit and um, give you all a little more. Alright, so um, the pavilion is kinda cool though. It <laughs> oh boy. Use Windows Hello. A password can easily be stolen. Windows Hello provides your combination. Device plus biometrics. Password. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hi guys, so um, again, give me a I can't believe I had a shot cut off every time, but you know. Yeah, so I like what I was like five ports and stuff and meet Cortana. There it is. There it is. Hi. Who oh, happy you're here? Getting things ready, please don't turn off your PC. So this is this is it. This is the um computer. I wonder if you got um, Microsoft Word. There it is. Um, so Microsoft Word is there. I'm seeing Minecraft, but I don't know if I have to download it. Let me see. If that came pre-installed. I don't think. Yeah, you see, because the thing popping up now, so. Those obviously were not um meant to But I must say I'm impressed. I am thoroughly Oh it has Netflix, it has Netflix too and it has people price line. I would say this is one impressive behemoth of a computer and <laughs> I can't wait to see what else it can do, but first, um, I guess, I guess that's it for now, because we did the unboxing, we did the setup, and everything's working like it's shit. Oh, I didn't even check the Seagate. This thing, it works. I guys are going, I am going, thank you so much for... I'm um, watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I will catch you in the next one.